Hey everyone, welcome back to Caleb Plays the Movie during this special Goofing Off Christmas episode. I'm here with my good friend and comrade, Kyle Glockner. <laughs> and if you, look, if you look behind me at the screen, you might know what we're playing. And if you looked at the title of this video, you might have known that we're playing. Let's wait and see if, if, if you guys can tell. Kyle, do you know? No, man, the screen is dark. It's really dark. <laughs> I can barely see that clock. It's making up for their 2004 graphics. Man, this game truly did come out in 2000. That should give you a little hint as to what we're playing. That's a hint, guys. Ooh, it could be literally any video game that came out in 2004 that relates to a movie. So far, I would guess Monster House if I were you, but that's not the answer. Well, it's a spoiler. It could be Monster House. <laughs> it could be Monster House. I was wrong. But instead... Is this just movie footage? I, is it? I remember... Pol oh, I mean, the movie this might be always looked kind of weird. Oh. Wait. It oh. just said it. It's... Guys, it's it's the Polar Express game. It's pr Whoa! Whoa! Pretty epic. Whoa! What do we got? Oh. One of the most... What are our options? One of the most beloved Christmas movies of our generation. Even though... Me? I haven't seen it. Kyle, have you seen it? I think. <laughs> Maybe. A, a big moral <laughs> quandary was... Have I, I may have watched this movie, but have I truly seen it? <laughs> the slowest page. Absolutely turn. incredible. <laughs> the slowest page turn. Name it. I like the noise. <laughs> oh. Ass. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. Tom Hanks, right? I think. Yeah, this is just footage from the movie. Yep. In hyper widescreen. <laughs> it's in the narrowest. It's like you're watching it from a little door hole. Yeah. It's like you're watching it like you're, you're looking outside like a peephole. It's like how the song says you saw mommy kissing Santa Claus. This is it. you saw mommy playing. The Polar Mom, mommy playing Polar Express for the GameCube. I feel like this is in like. Minute 20 of the movie. Minute 20 of the movie, minute one what? of the game. Kyle, you know what I just realized? I do, I have seen parts of this movie. Wait. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> what is, oh no! Who is this character? I think that's Scrooge. But... Was he always a puppet? <laughs> Always don't look as good as the movie did. I gotta wonder, like, in 2004, did people think this looked good? Was this like... <laughs> like what else came out in... <laughs> like, I'm trying to... <laughs> no, we'll do we doing it again. Games that came out in 2004. I don't think there were as many, like... Great ones. Uh, Half-Life 2. Halo 2. Halo 2, okay. Uh, World, oh. World of Warcraft. Oh, this is not bad. This is so smooth. Oh. Kyle, run around like that. It's so, it's so smooth. <laughs> uh, I'll leave you before I move on. Metal Gear Solid 3, Snake Eater. <laughs> like putting butter on a hot slab of corn. <laughs> uh, Pikmin 2 came out in 2004. Drew? Mr. Brown? Mr. Brown? Yeah, Far Cry. Um... Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door came out in 2004 on the GameCube alongside this title. Thousands of kids. Nay, millions. <laughs> All right. I am almost dead. <laughs> what do you do do? I am dead. You have five continues remaining. What happens after we exhaust those? If, you, if you've seen the goofing off live show, you saw how upset I was at the Remy death screen. He's just... Oh. What? Oh, no! no. Remy, Wait, no! No, no! You saw how upset I was, but I feel like they'd have to be truly madmen if they would animate a scene where a child just dies. <laughs> I think that's, I think that would drive up the rating of the game. 
What if, uh, what if there was just a sequel to the Polar Express hidden on this disc? <laughs> they made a whole sequel, never released it. Exclusive to GameCube. And no one's ever found it, except me. We it is exclusive it. goofing off content. Goof- Whoa. I don't, it's, it's so I don't like the camera flip, it makes me feel not good. <laughs> oh, I got him. He's like, oh! Man, what a- <clears throat> What a revolutionary game to use the full 300. Oh, get that toy! Uh, Wait, you have a double, double jump? jump? What movie? This is a lot of people's favorite Christmas movie. That's the thing. That's bizarre. <laughs> All right, this gonna... weirdly <clears throat> animated Beowulf style. Yeah, I. I have seen clips of that Beowulf. I don't like it. I don't either. That's what it reminded me of. It's just like weirdly... It's like as if like they were trying to like make everyone look like a, a good video game. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, did you just spike that? <laughs> Ooh, I'm, I'm getting too cocky. This is... This is ridiculous. How many puppets are there?! Okay, I can't take any more. Yeah, and our endless supply of cakes and cookies. Maybe, maybe we're the puppets. Wait, is this like a he can't see you type of? Oh, oh, this is just like that famous scene in this Jurassic is... Park. Okay, give it a shot. You got it. All right. The segment is now Kyle plays the movie. Caleb, remake the whole intro. Go. Oh no. That. No, I'm being like, what was that? <laughs> the boy just goes. There you go. I'm scared though. <laughs> da, 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 da. All right, we did it. Wow. Now um, it's back to Caleb. a bit of teamwork. Yeah. <laughs> Walked right over that little door. <laughs> what is that? This is like Wii Sports Resort. Excuse me, sir. Well, what? 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 Man, this game truly is innovative. Man, like, toss it into the basket. We have not played a single mini game that has been similar to another one. Oh, wait. What? Catch up with the. Oh no! I was reading. He died. <laughs> I was reading. What? I can't even duck! He's dead! You gotta dodge, dude. This is This intense. is good. It's getting good, guys. We were, we were fools for oh. doubting this film-based oh. movie. Oh. Speaking of movies that came out in 2002, Four. or 2004, Spider-Man 2? Yeah. A famous scene on top of a train? Hmm. Hmm. What, what's the point of this right now? What's he doing? Who's driving? <laughs> Wait, yeah, the conductor... The man who is supposed to... I just jumped on that wire thing. Yeah, listen. What do I do there? What? What do I do there? Gamers? Gamers, please lend us your energy to beat the Polar Express for the GameCube. Please. I don't know. I have no clue. What's I his... Just know what's that his game here. I must win. What 10 year old is being like, yeah, I got this in the first try. Wait. Wait. Hello? Is there someone there? I did it. Well, oh, the guy with the fire. What? Guys, Caleb, every criticism I threw your way, you just shot them out of the water. This is awesome. This is awesome. What? 
Whose home is this? Sorry. <laughs> They're just chilling watching Shrek 2. Do you think that's Drew's loft apartment? I think it was, guys. I, let's check in on Drew's loft apartment. How you doing, Drew? Mm, there it is. Okay. Amazing. That's Thrilling. You have to go, Caleb. Go. Initiate maximum overdrive. <laughs> Oh, no. All right, this is the real maximum overdrive. Go. Maybe. Run. D go. D well. Everyone. I didn't make it. But you know what did make it? To the holiday spirit. And this Polar Express video game, as we know it, oh, has, has ended. Thank you for watching. Can Thank you, play you some so movie? very much. Thank you so much for watching Thank me you. ski. Um, battle toys. We, um, we've truly played like 10 games in this one experience. What is that? A little whistle. We got it. <laughs> <laughs> um, it thank you so much lives. for watching me play Polar Express and games all semester long. I really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Truly an amazing experience. Um, I hope you have a great holiday season. I know I will playing this game all holiday long. Trying to beat this skiing level. Um, for Kyle Glockner, I've been Caleb Morgan, and thank you for watching me play the movie. Enjoy. Enjoy the holiday. <laughs>